for the fun part. <laughs> um, we are going to apply the acrylic now. So, I'm going to start with the white first. Now, take your brush. And your acrylic. I have my acrylic liquid, uh, pink acrylic, and white acrylic in a paper towel to wipe on. Okay. So I'm going to start with my pinky first. Okay, dip your brush in there. Make sure it's pretty good and wet. Squeeze a little bit of that excess liquid off into the dappin' dish. And then... Just take your brush and pull it towards you and pick up some product. See, I got a little ball there. It should be nice and wet. And then just apply it on. Rub the brush again. Dip it in more of the acetone. Kind of play with it. kind of got a lot of product on that ball that I just pulled so be sure that you're being pretty careful about that it's pretty easy to pull out a lot But it can be fixed at the end when you file it all down. Okay, I'm going to continue the same steps on the next finger. This is that finger. It looks kind of chunky right now, but I will file it all down in a bit.
So, what I do to create the C curve is I take a fingernail, dip it in the monomer, and then just put it on there. And kind of pull out. Okay, that's what it looks like after I pull the little C curve in it with the nail. Okay, now that I have all the white acrylic on there, I am now going to put the pink acrylic on. Now it's time to buff. I have all the acrylic on there. It's all gunky. Okay, now that I have finished filing, I found um, the sides, my free edge, and the top with this file. And then I went over it with this buffing block and smoothed the top of it, basically. So now that everything is all smooth, um, I'm going to go ahead and, um, first of all, Remove all the dust and then I'm gonna add the buffing cream and I'm gonna buff my nails. And you just kinda take a very small little bit of it, like this much on your fingers, and then just 
put it on the top of each finger. And just kind of buff it all out. Now what I'm doing, um, you need to add cuticle oil to your nails and then wash your hands. But since I do not have cuticle oil, I am using extra virgin olive oil. Just a capful of it and just put your fingers and dab it on there on each finger. I'm going to be applying my top coat and I'm using Rimmel Base Coat Top Coat Pro. I've already washed my hands. And you're just gonna apply that to each finger. Okay guys, I am all finished now. Here's the end product. Yay. Thank you everybody for watching. Don't forget to comment whatever you want to be. Anyway, so happy with the end result.